So what I have here is a handheld air raid siren. I'm using my cordless angle grinder. So I made a, a prototype to see if it would work. And it works, but it's a little bit rough. What I'll do now is just modify it and refine it. I'll show you what I got so far. Throughout the video, I'll be testing the siren and I'll keep it at a lower volume up until the end and then it will be at full volume. So to start, I have taken apart my angle grinder and I've measured this piece and it is two inches and that'll match my Forstner bit. Perfect fit. So I've made this small block and I put a, a bolt in it and it'll attach to this piece. Here I've divided this uh, circle and cut out one of the blades and mark this piece here so I can cut seven more blades. Here I just made a small jig and this is so I can trim the rotor so it's completely round. I can do this on the table saw or I can do it with the belt sander. So I'm changing my plans a little bit. I tested this one in my grinder, so it blew off all the blades. I was gonna make it like this and then put my second stator on top of here. But it, this one holds up, but I guess the other one went way too fast, so it blew them all off. So I've reduced them to this size, and now I can glue this piece on here. So I glued seven blades on the bottom and I'll put eight blades on the top.
So I've just put a string onto my belt sander and tied it to the rotor and you can see it's not balanced properly. So I'll remove some of the wood on the one side to help balance it out. So I've drilled a few holes and it looks a lot better now. I've taken out the old router out of my prototype and I just put the new one in to see if it would work. And I'll still have to build up a better stator. I'll just put on, just put on my earplugs. That works really good. To turn in this um, screw, I had to make this little tool here. So it just fits like that, and now I can turn it in. So I've cut seven pieces here, and they will be the stator, so I'll glue them onto here. Well, I just cut this ring and I'll glue it on top of here like so. Here I've marked eight of these pieces and they will glue onto here. So the top one has eight and the bottom has seven and that'll give it a two-tone pitch. Now these blocks are dry. And I just cut this ring and it'll, I'll glue this onto here and then it, it'll be complete. Now it's ready for testing. Here I'm going to test it and you may want to turn your volume down. <laughs> 